Hi, welcome to Free Spirit and welcome to another deck collection. So this is something I treated myself to at the beginning of this year and um, they're really special. I'm going to put down below, some of you may not be familiar with Cryon, I wasn't. Uh, it actually was somebody that listened to my channel and my messages and they brought it to my attention, Cryon, because they said some of my messages reminded me of some of the channelings uh, with Cryon, which is all channeling from Lee Carroll. So I was oblivious to this. She directed me to a website, which I'll put down below. And um, I was reading on a Sunday, rainy Sunday, all these channelings from Cryon, uh, from Magnetic Service, um, channelings from Lee Carroll. I'll give you the website that I was reading. But I, I, it blew me away because it, it did mirror a lot of the messages or the energy or the tone of like what I get. I'm not saying it is cryon, but I recognize the tone and some of the messages. Um, and what really struck me was a lot of the messages that the channelings always say, we are aware of who we're speaking to and who will later find it. And um, the channelings always ended with, and so it is cryon. Um, and so it is. And as I was reading more and more channelings, uh, the ones that hit closer to me or really reminded me of the love that I felt, uh, all I kept on getting bathed with was like, oh my God, I know that energy. I know that similar energy and the messages. And I'm so in love with that energy. I'm so in love with that energy. That's all I could feel. I just love that energy. I wish I was always feeling it to the degree of when I get direct spirit messages. And on that particular channeling at the very end, it didn't end with so and so it is. It ended with, and I'm in love with humanity. And I had a wave and it was so powerful. I can't explain it, but I'm giving that as an example because you may find that personally, that everything is so interconnected. And a lot of, when I first began this uh, channel, I was wobbly. I knew I was guided to do it, but, um, and they were saying, you know, it's not just for who's gonna immediately see it, but for people later down the road. And just like Cryon and Lee Carroll, he put all these channelings together decades ago. And here I am reading it and it's feeding me just as it was intended. Like spirit, it's, it, you know, outside time and space. And just like in the channelings, they know who comes, who will see it later. Um, so I'm sharing that with you because you could feel that in your own personal life. And yes, absolutely, spirit knows when you see it and it's all interconnected and it's beyond the scope of our perspective. But I treated myself to these three. Um, I will definitely put down where you can get the decks and I'll also give you the channelings from Cryon so you can lose yourself or dip into it if you so choose. But these are the three decks that have come out that are inspired by Cryon uh, channelings. And this is from Monica Morani. I hope I'm pronouncing her name, but she did Gaia Revealed, Renew Your Relationship with Mother Earth, Manifesting Your Mastery, and then we have Cryon Oracle Cards. Um, so I'm just gonna give you a brief sampling of what each one is. And then um, I'm gonna do separate videos dedicated to showing every card because I wanna be fed. I always say we need to be directly fed. I feel like this type of energy directly feeds us so we can fill our cup and go forth with what we're supposed to be doing. This was the energy in which I treated myself with these decks. Um, so let's start with Gaia Revealed. So each deck has 44 cards. Again, I'm gonna show a close-up review of each deck, but I just wanted to give a brief in, you know, review. Here, every deck will come with colored pictures and it will give a whole message and channeling. I love this, alignment with Gaia. And here, alignment with Gaia. Let's look at the backs of the cards are beautiful. These are stunning cards. And here I will have a channeled message, alignment with Gaia, you know, ascended land. I'm just flipping through. I'm going to do a close-up review of each one and actually read each card. But these are stunning messages, compassionate action, connected with Gaia, cooperation of Gaia, crystalline grid of Gaia, crystal, crystals of Gaia, so energies of Gaia. So it is, Gaia exists for humans. Yes. Gaia is a partner. Gaia is here for you. So you get the message. But I am going to Gaia knows you. Gaia loves you. These are beautiful uh, messages that I'm going to do a close-up review and eat, read each and every card. Because I want it on my channel and I want to be able to check in and get a message whenever I want, to be honest with you. 
Um, and the energies behind these cards are so huge. I want to break it down into individual videos, your essence and Gaia. But this is the Gaia Reveals Renew Your Relationship with Mother Earth. And I'll put the link down below. It does come with a guidebook. Okay. And here we have that. 44 cards in a guidebook. Then we have manis Manifesting Your Mastery Affirmation Cards. These are stunning cards too. It also comes with a guidebook that manifesting your mastery and it will have the channeling to support it too uh affirmations to each card you know this is what it's giving you and here even the colors have significance this is manifesting your mastery affirmation cards so these are the backs of the cards and then each one you have pink for for love family love you have light of the creator for purple you see the, how it's going? Perfect DNA. You have templates and blueprints. Yellow, work I love. Successful business, I allow myself to receive. The blue, my existence matters. Exist and love God. Passion, power, purpose, divine purpose. Then we have the rainbow, essence of God. My needs are always met. I create synchronicity, universal love and support. Old soul wisdom, life of joy. I'm divinity within. I'm definitely going to do a close-up review to read, you know, show, read each card. I just wanted to give an overview. This is manifesting your mastery affirmation cards from Monica Morani, Morani, and from inspired by the Cryon channels channelings from Lee Carroll. So then we go into Cryon, the actual oracle cards from Lee Carroll. Also 44 cards. And it comes with a guidebook. Let's go into the guidebook. And here it's literally the channeled message. Benevolent energy, my gosh. I'm gonna read each and every one, but these are the backs of the cards. And then you go here and it will be Akashic lineage. This is all essence of light here, always with God. Belonging to the creator, benevolent energy. Celebrate what's coming creating synchronicity, eternal family, I mean, make no mistake, help from spirit, what's even coming through right here, recalibration of self, right place, right time. I'm also going to go through these on a close-up review, reading each and every card to show how beautiful, and you'll recognize if you get direct spirit messages or feel love and backing from spirit, it's the same similar energy. Um, it was very recognizable to me, though it may come in different forms, language, tone to you, it's the energy of of love and knowledge and wisdom. Um, so this was my New Year's treat to myself to get all three. I'll put links down below and also the website for the Cryon channelings if you want to dive deeper. Um, he has he has it in video form, but also in inscription form, you know, just reading the actual channelings, which I preferred reading it for some reason because how I get spirit messages, I hear it in my head. Um, so I preferred to read it for some reason. I resonated much more to that uh, uh, versus a video for some reason, hearing a voice. Uh, it was much better coming through my own mind when reading. So um, I'll put a link to that. But I wanted to show you all three. I treated myself to, and I will over... Um, the next couple of days go through each deck and read every card because I definitely want it to sink in. I feel we need direct uh, feedings as much as possible, especially during this time. And so that's why I wanted to share this deck collection to show all three Oracle decks that exist coming from the inspiration of Cryon um, energy and channelings. And then I'm going to do an individual close-up review of each one to read every single card to um yeah, so that even you get that energy and the message even that way, even if you stop by. And the interconnectedness of it all was just amazing to me. And I think Donna, who was the person who brought it to my attention when she stumbled on my channel and then she showed me, you know, come look at this because this is very similar. Um, and the interconnectedness of it all and the love of, that the loving energy that's there for us to stumble on almost like what I say those breadcrumbs along our path that we're not alone sometimes it feels like we're very much alone in what we're doing but that it's so backed and supported and then all of a sudden there's a breadcrumb to further directly feed you that yes you're supported you're guided we're here for you kind of thing so this has been the deck collection of the cryon oracle decks Gaia revealed renew your relationship with mother earth the cryon oracle cards and manifesting your destiny affirmation cards Monica Morani inspired by 
by the writings of Cryon. And I'm also gonna put that website so you can read the channelings if you so choose. Um, yeah, so this has been my deck collection review for all the Cryon Oracle decks that are out. And I will slowly but surely be putting close-up reviews to go through every single card. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.